guys, it's Michaela from Lux News Live, and I'm here with Lauren from The Skinny Confidential, and we can't wait to get the skinny in just a few seconds. Cheers. Cheers. Hey guys, so I'm here with Lauren from The Skinny Confidential, and I just have to say, you're so much more fabulous in person. I loved talking to you. You're so funny. I know you've Thank been you. traveling all day long. You were in Aspen yesterday, Vegas today, LA tomorrow. How are you doing it? Are you doing okay? You look gorgeous. It's crazy. Honestly, we're always traveling lately. We have two dogs, so we kind of have to like facilitate them. My biggest trick for travel right now is you take green tea bags with caffeine in them. You can order them from room service, and then you take a spoon and you put the spoon in freezing cold ice water and you let the spoon sit and then you seep the tea bags in like hot water and you put it on your eyes while the spoon's sitting in there. After the tea bags have been sitting on your eyes for like five minutes, you take it off and then you put the cold spoon. So that's been saving my life. Oh. You just lay it on your eyes and it's amazing because the caffeine kind of tightens everything. Yeah. And the cold spoon takes the swelling down. I love, in the first two seconds, we already have the most fabulous tip. <laughs> I love that, that's amazing. Now what do you want, because so many people are watching, they're loving you, I'm loving you. What do you want the Skinny Confidential? What What is the whole entire message? What do you really want to embody? I think that it's just being the best version of yourself. And what the Skinny Confidential is, is there's no definition of what the best version is. Like I told you earlier, you can have whatever you want to be your best life, but it's almost about creating your own destiny and you doing you. Yeah, I love that. Okay, now one quick little question that I have for you. Yeah. You asked me, but now I'm gonna ask you. I love it. What is your favorite, Snapchat or the Instagram story? The Insta story. Definitely Snapchat, and I gotta tell you mm -hmm. why. Snapchat to me is more BTS, which means behind the scenes, and I think that's what people want to see now. They want to see the raw, real movement of people. Um, Instagram story to me still is on Instagram, and Instagram is very um, curated, and, and the pictures are curated, and so to do like an Instagram story just doesn't feel authentic. I have an audience that I'm super loyal to on Snapchat as well. And I think to kind of abandon that and just go to Instagram story wouldn't be right. I also love the filters on Snapchat. Beauty amazing. filter. Yeah. I love Snapchat. I feel like you're producing your own reality show. I love that. So for the people that will be following you after this, of course, what are some of the things that we could see on your Snapchat that maybe we don't get to see on the blog? There's so much you can see on my Snapchat that you don't see on the blog. You can see me making fun of my husband. I do that on a daily basis. You can see um, my house, my chihuahuas, like the work that kind of goes into it. You see the odd hours I work. Right now it's midnight. Uh, we're in Vegas. We're working. It's just, it's a very different way to connect with the audience. And it's kind of like saying like, this is the real life. There's no filter. There's no facade besides the dog filter. And here I am. Which no one's judging you for. I think the deluxe version viewers have gotten so much great information. I know that I have. Thank you so much. Thank you. You're for so lovely. Me. I cannot wait to follow you on Snapchat and everything in life. Thank you for saving mine. <laughs> it's been a pleasure. You're beautiful. Thank you. Thank for you. Me. Of course.